Back in the day, 3D printing was locked behind industrial labs and corporations. You needed heavy budgets, complex know-how, and serious gear just to get started. Fast forward to 2025, and now you can get a high-performing 3D printer for under a few hundred dollars, right from Amazon, to make prototypes, miniatures, custom parts, or even gifts. We cut through hype and test real products so you don't waste money. And just so you know, all the Amazon best deal links are down in the description below, so if one of these catches your eye, you can check specs or order in a click. Today, I'm counting down the top four best 3D printers of 2025 that balance quality, ease, and value. Let's jump right in, starting with number four. Number four, Creality Ender 3 Max Neo. At number four, we have the Creality Ender 3 Max Neo. This model brings a lot of big printer features into a cost-effective package. Its build volume of 11.8 by 11.8 by 12.6 inches gives you plenty of room for larger prints, from functional parts to oversized models. What sets it apart? It includes CR Touch Auto Leveling, which removes one of the biggest headaches in 3D printing, manually leveling the bed. It also features a dual Z-axis system for better stability and precision, especially on taller prints. The full metal extruder ensures durability and better filament grip, reducing issues like slipping or under-extrusion. In testing, the Ender 3 Max Neo handled standard PLA and PETG with ease. Even prints with overhangs and slight bridges came out surprisingly clean for this price tier. The frame is rigid and well-assembled, which reduces wobble during longer prints. One downside, the printer is a bit bulky and takes up a decent amount of space, so you'll need a stable, flat surface to set it up. Also, while auto-leveling helps, you'll still want to run calibration routines occasionally to maintain quality. Best 4. Makers who want large print volume, fewer leveling hassles, and longevity without breaking the bank. Less ideal for users wanting ultra-compact or travel-friendly setups. If you're planning to build bigger prints without stepping into pro territory, the Ender 3 Max Neo is a compelling option. Number 3. Elegoo Neptune 3 Pro Climbing to number 3, the Elegoo Neptune 3 Pro is a sleek, feature-rich machine that appeals to both beginners and intermediate users. It offers an 8.85 by 8.85 by 11-inch build area, smaller than number 4, but enough for most common use cases. Its standout features include quick assembly, you can get it ready in minutes, a direct drive extruder, which helps with flexible filaments, and auto-leveling for a smoother start. The PEI flexible platform is a joy, you can just bend it and your prints pop off. The touchscreen is intuitive and responsive. In tests, the Neptune 3 Pro produced clean, detailed results on PLA, PETG, and even TPU. Overhangs and fine details like miniature filigree came out sharp for this price tier. The direct drive helps reduce stringing, and print quality remains stable across longer jobs. The main limitations are that very large parts, greater than its build volume, won't be possible, and for very high-speed printing, the rigidity is good but not on par with full metal core printers. Best 4. Users who want an all-in-one, easy-to-use, versatile 3D printer that handles a variety of materials. Less ideal for makers needing very large print capacity or industrial-level rigidity. If you want a reliable machine with modern conveniences, the Neptune 3 Pro is a fantastic middle ground. Number 2. Flashforge Adventurer 5M At number 2, we shift gears with Flashforge Adventurer 5M. This one is built like a race car. It's a Core XY all-metal frame printer, which means motion is fast and stable. Its print area is 220 by 220 by 220 millimeters, approximately 8.66 in each axis, making it capable of large prints. What makes the 5M tempting? Fully automatic leveling, a 3S detachable nozzle that allows quick swaps or maintenance, and speed. This printer can push towards 600 mm per second in certain conditions for faster prototyping. The direct extruder supports a range of filaments up to 280 degrees. During my tests, the Adventurer 5M held up well even under faster print speeds. For standard quality prints, it delivered sharp edges and clean surfaces. The all-metal structure helped reduce vibrations at higher speeds. 
That said, when pushed to extremes, you'll see artifacts, not unusual in the budget realm. Also, high-speed printing will sometimes require very fine tuning of slicer settings to avoid quality loss. Best 4. Advanced hobbyists who want speed, versatility, and higher-end features without paying pro-level pricing. Less ideal for newbies who prefer plug-and-play simplicity over fine-tuning control. For folks who want to go fast and keep print quality high, the Adventurer 5M is a beast in its class. Number 1. Creality Ender 3 V2 Neo And finally, at number 1, the Creality Ender 3 V2 Neo reigns supreme in the budget 3D printer world. It comes 95% pre-assembled, features CR Touch auto-leveling, a PC spring steel build plate, and a full metal extruder. Its build volume is a little more modest, 8.66 by 8.66 by 9.84 inches, but that's enough for most practical projects. What makes the V2neo special is how well it balances usability, performance, and reliability. It's considered one of the best bang-for-buck printers. In tests, it produced clean prints right out of the box with minimal tuning. The spring steel plate helps with adhesion during printing and effortless removal afterward. It also supports resume print features for power outages or interruptions, which is a huge plus if you're running long jobs. While it's not going to match Metalcore Pro rigs, for under $300 to $350, it gives tremendous value. Its downsides include the smaller build volume, compared to number 4 and number 2, and needing occasional calibration, but those are minor for what you get. Best for beginners, tinkerers, educators, or anyone wanting a reliable, capable printer with minimal compromise. Less ideal for users who frequently print very large objects or demand extreme speed out of the box. If I had to pick one 3D printer to recommend to most people in 2025, this is the one. And that's a wrap! The top 4 best 3D printers of 2025 you can get on Amazon without blowing your budget. Whether you need size, speed, ease, or a bit of everything, there's a model on this list for you. Which one are you eyeing for your next build? Drop your pick down in the comments. I want to hear what you'd love to print with. And remember, all the Amazon Best Deal links are right down in the description so you can check them out and grab the one that fits your needs. Until next time, print bold, dream big, and create something awesome.